Ew. I just moved into my new house yesterday. On the day Kobe Bryant died. I'm always going to remember that. But anyways, look. Nicki Minaj's... That's the attic light. Fuck. Nicki Minaj's brother gets 25 life. That's sick. My son's right there. The guy's sick. Yo. The freaking crazy thing about this is, look, man. I don't care about anything or anybody at any given point. Except my son. <laughs> so I don't really follow Nicki Minaj and what she does and what she doesn't do. I don't care what she does. I really don't. But I do know, doing a little brief reading, that she paid for his legal defense. Bella, you heard that? Bella. Bella. She paid for his legal defense. For smashing a... She, she couldn't even believe it. For smashing an 11-year-old girl or 13, whatever. Man, it's a kid. Whatever. I don't care how old she was. You sick freaking puppy. Son of a... You know what I'm saying. But yeah. Look, man. 25 to life is too short. He's probably gonna spend the rest of his life in there because you know, I don't think pedophiles are. No, I'm actually I'm li I'm lying. Twenty five to life is a pretty good deal when you're a pedophile because they usually let those people out all the time. Trust me. Now, if you sell drugs, the parole board's gonna look at you in twenty five years and be like, no, click. But if you rape a little kid in twenty five years, this guy's gonna go to the parole board. I don't know how old he is. He fucking looks like forty something to me, so he'll probably be a lot. The parole board's gonna look up in 25 years like, oh, you just raped the kid. Boom, let him free. Because, you know, that's the world we live in. And that's all I got to say. The world is sick. The justice system is even sicker. Guarantee, I've never seen, I've never heard, I've never seen a news clip, I've never read an article where a pedophile dies in prison. Like, he gets such a long sentence. Like, these motherfuckers are always let out. Probably even on a pill. This guy might do, like, five or freaking ten years or some crazy shit like that and just walk out. Because, like I said, the government doesn't care about stuff like that. Now, but if you sell drugs like the pharmacists in CVS and Walgreens that fucking misprescribe people every day and kill them by mistake, that's wrong. You're going to spend the rest of your life in prison. And I, I usually I don't. And I laugh can't believe I showed this. I usually don't drink soda, but I, like I said, I just moved into my new house. And uh, I'm too lazy to unpack all this shit. So I'm buying food every day until I get all this shit fixed. And then I can eat, like, cook food and drink my water and shit. But until then, Pepsi, I'm going to drink you right now. I shouldn't. It's disgusting. It's way too much sugar. But it, it's what needs to be done right now. <laughs> all right.